guys good morning and welcome back to another beautiful video guys and today we are doing this differently and i hope you love this new version of my filming because i'll be putting more of my face out there because i need to interact and connect with you guys yes and we have this little yellow hoodie on guys which i really love and i'm putting it on because the weather is really chilly guys and buddy wanted to be on camera Yes, so that's why I have him with me. Yeah, so wave, say hi. Hi, wave, Baba. Wave, hi, wave, buddy. Okay, guys, so we'll get down to business. And the first um, order of the day that we're going to do, the first duty that is going to make breakfast. So let's go, guys, because I have some arrow roots. I'm just gonna show you guys here. I just bought them. Uh, the other day from the market so i'm just uh going ahead to prepare them for breakfast for breakfast so let's go And guess what? I only had like a really small portion of these arrow roots to cook, guys, because most of them, like three or more than three quarters, I don't know what to say. I felt really disappointed. Guys, I felt bad for my money, my coins. So that's why I had to cook what was left. So I remained I removed all the rotten parts and then I remained with the skeletons, and that's what I cooked. And it's only my hubby who ate them because it was a very, very little uh, small portion. And then we ended up eating something else for breakfast, guys. So let's go ahead and cook these arrows because my baby is already on the door and he's shouting. So And guys, after having rotten arrow roots, I just realized I don't have gas. So I had to call this guy to refill my cylinder. Uh, he did the refill pretty fast. It took, I think, about uh, 30 minutes. And then afterwards, I thought we were on track. But no, wait a minute. The gas was not lighting up. I had to call him back. He had gone to do delivery somewhere else. So I had to wait. So this took more than an hour later for me to start cooking, guys. But all the same, we have to cook yes so what happened after fixing the gas is that i was told there was a lot of pressure that was trapped on the passageway because they had re refilled the cylinder overfilled so you had to put it out release a bit of the gas and put it back guys and we were back on track so let's cook and family like i had said before the arrow roots was not enough for us guys because yeah the disappointment i talked about and guys please excuse the noise it's coming from the kids who are playing outside but i have to do this voice over now yes so we are having this for breakfast guys and i'm using avocado on my bread as a spread because i don't i uh, like margarine uh, in my bread unless i'm using it uh, on toasted bread and then my hubby just brought this thing in and now my baby cannot let go of it he has to eat it it's called wow wow and he really loves it it's the one uh, the cheese and the onions and i don't like it when my baby eats it because i feel like it's way too processed Yes, the coloration is just boring for me. I feel like it's really unhealthy, but then he insists on eating it because he had seen it, guys. I will let him eat it for now. But then I'll try as much as possible to feed him on the healthy food. So let's go finish up the, with the breakfast and we we'll see what next. And let me tell you guys, this girl can cook. Provided I'm home, I'm free, I have what to cook and my gas cooker is on. I can cook all day, okay? So we were on to making lunch now. And what I'm making is actually uh, this. I'm making green bananas, uh, matoke. And I'm going to make it with chapatis because I've really craved this combination for a while. So I'm going ahead to prepare chapatis, but just 
a few of them so let's go ahead and finish up with the frying the matoke then we start making preparing the chapati Guys, at this point, I want to tell you, uh, I'm really looking into buying a new pan for cooking chapatis because I, ideally I don't have one. As you can see, this one used to be a nonstick, but a moment of silence for it because it has become a normal pan. Someone started scrubbing it with a steel roll and it got spoiled. So this is what I'm using right now, but I hope I get one soon. But guys, this chapati is tasted really good. So I'm just going ahead to put all of them on the plate then I show you guys how they look. It's midnight. I'm outside. Your car's warm. Did you just get home? I can't drive. I won't cry. Who's inside? I feel so alone. And guys, apologies for the echo. I have changed the location where I'm doing the, the editing. Yeah, but we move on regardless. So I'm going to make porridge for my boy, uh, Ujia Gioni. And my baby is not such a fan of porridge. So I always find ways of just tricking him to take the porridge. So today I'll be changing the flour that I'm using. I'll just use uh, this one, the flour that I use for my ugali, the white one. Yeah, I want to trick him to take it because uh, he's been used to the other one. I used to Afia and he has not taken it for the past three days. So I'm just changing to see if uh, maybe I'll trick him to start taking the porridge, then probably he'll be able to finish. So that's why I'm making white porridge for today. So let's go ahead and uh, finish this, then I show you guys what next. I'm outside. Your car's warm. Did you just get home? I can't drive. I won't cry. Who's inside? I feel so alone. alone. There's only 2% of my phone. phone. Wake your ass up and come answer the door. Door. You don't get to be good when I And I've had my baby already. He managed to take the porridge really well. So I had a portion for myself. Guys, I love drinking porridge a lot. I don't know if it's drinking or taking. Yeah, something like that. So what you're going to do, guys, I'm going to do cleaning for my bedroom and I want to loop you guys in. So what I'm starting by doing over here is just uh, ironing the bed sheets. Guys, I prefer ironing my bed sheets because I do feel like sometimes they're way too creased and also ironing will... Uh, kill any germs that uh, maybe did not die with the soap or something like that. I just feel like it looks uh, way more presentable ironed rather than not ironed. Yes. So let's go ahead iron this then uh, we'll go we'll head into the bedroom to start up with the cleaning because that place is in a mess guys. I'm gonna show you that in it's a bit. Midnight. I'm outside. Your car's warm. Did you just get home? I can't drive. I won't cry. Who's inside? I feel so alone, alone. And there's only two percent on my phone, phone. Wake your ass up and come answer the door, door. You don't get to be good when I don't.
and guys welcome to my messy bedroom my disorganized my oh my god can you see the containers are everywhere i even have the bag that i was using on friday is still on the floor my hubby's shoes are just all over the place and uh, yeah we just got up and we didn't make the bed so this is what i'm gonna do and my baby is of course with me so let's go ahead and uh, start up with the cleaning so probably i start by collecting all the things that are down or uh, maybe with the bed let's just go ahead and see how this uh, works i'm outside your car's warm did you just get home i can't drive i won't cry who's inside i feel so alone alone and there's only two percent on my phone phone make your ass up and come answer the door you don't get to be good when I guys i don't even know why i didn't make my bed earlier see that how easy that was so we done with the bed i'm able to change the bed sheets so i'm just going ahead to fold uh, some of the blankets that my boy uses uh, that is one of them the purple leash and uh, i had changed part of my pillow cases last week but let me see i think they are still dirty so i'll just go ahead and uh, switch the two that i had ironed so yeah i'll change uh that also and guys my pillows are not in a good state guys there's just so much that i need to change in this house i hope god answers my prayers because i need to get money guys money 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 should come my way i need to grab it and just buy a lot of things i'll also be changing my pillows once i have the money so for now let's just change the pillowcases then we leave them um we arrange them so that the whole place looks nice before we head on to uh, organizing what's on the floor because I have a, a lot of shoes down on the floor and then after that I'll also be organizing the clothes inside this basket there's a lot of uh, uh, clothes that we have in the basket that are just lying there I need to separate probably any uh, any that we need to wear and also any that uh, is dirty the clean ones and the dirty ones I'll have to separate them because they are kind of mixed right now warm did you just get home i can't drive i won't cry who's inside i feel so alone alone and there's only two percent on my phone phone wake your ass up and come answer the door door you don't get to be good when i and just like that guys we are done with cleaning the room and guys it looks really neat at this point it was getting dark um so i decided to put the lights on because it was about uh, 6 pm so i'm just going to try to separate the items in this basket so that i put everything where it belongs and guys i think if you had seen before there was a sieve inside this basket that my boy had ferried from the kitchen to put here he brings a lot of utensils in the room so i just put it back so i'll go ahead to separate everything and put them uh, where they all belong especially the dirty clothes i have a laundry basket for dirty clothes in the other uh, room so that's what i'm gonna do guys then we'll go ahead to uh, probably do a few touch-ups here and there in the closet because i had i just arranged the clothes uh, the other weekend guys i don't do it every weekend uh, because it's still not that bad so i'm just going to do a few touch-ups here and there so that i arrange everything so that uh, they all look straight and uh, presentable 
then uh, i guess we're almost finishing guys so just stay put So how about we go in again and see how this looks yes yes so i managed to arrange everything and i'm just so happy that uh, i organized the room i really love it when my uh, bedroom is this organized it usually gives me a, a very satisfying feeling and guys my boy put his shoes on the stool and he never wanted to get them off so we let them stay there because he's the boss for now and i put my bags up on the wall guys because i don't have enough space in my closet yeah or anywhere else and guys i have this leather bag this red one that i just bought and uh, i don't know why it's doing that uh, the skin was really bad i wish i knew and guys this is how the closet also turned out and the entire room and thank you guys so much for your time i love you a lot bye